Yes, 
Tukweba za mukama katona forabo mukama katona febo sumuru de makomera gona Mweba zorabio nabi akose Zechimanyo inembera mukama jaku je mungo wecho chisubira Wona woli yimuse mikono jo mweba ze Yimuso mutima guo mweba ze We thank you Jesus We thank you for the cross We thank you Jesus
masongo musinza genda masongo mugulumiza nebi gambo byakamwako and as you worship him and glorify him with the words of your mouth just like you've been singing it and telling him he's the only one speak it with the words of your mouth worship him glorify him give him the honor he so deserves speak of the Lord we worship you we glorify you today's evening. We give you the praise and the honor, sir. And we say you are worthy. Spirit of God. You are worthy. The spirit that helps us. You are worthy. You are worthy. The spirit of greatness. The spirit of the Lord, we worship you. We glorify you, sir. We give you honor and praise. We welcome your ministers. For we cannot on our own without you. Spirit of the Lord, like you did in the beginning, no mamira. And you hovered even today's evening. Seven kuyise. Sir, I invite you. Django mamire. Come and hover. Django mamire. Come and hover. Django mamire. Come and hover. Omoyo wa mukama. Spirit of the Lord, mamire chifuchino. Hover this place. Mamire mioja fe. Hover our spirits. Mamire mitima jafe. Hover our hearts. Mamira buli imbera. Hover every situation. Eva dema sekati kafe. That was a minister of Asa. To kuani this. We welcome you, Spirit of the Father. Take your first place. Take on your throne of reign. In today's service, glorify yourself and every power of the devil. And all the scandals of the devil. We pray that the Spirit of the Lord may your purpose sing and your will be done today's evening. We want to thank you, Lord. You brought us for a purpose. There is a reason why you got us from where we were and brought us before you, sir. That's why I pray, sir. You were guided at feet and brought us in this place, sir. To see Meet us. Meet that lady. Meet that gentleman. Sir. There are those who came with trouble. There are those who came with There are those who came with questions. And they had no answers. I confirm you have the answer. And to this man is this I confirm you have the answer. This woman is needed. I prayed for those two who are in the nation. That are on the line. That are over the radio. Meet that gentleman. Meet that lady. Who are in the city? Room. Who are the apostles? Who are in the vehicles? Who are in the church? Meet them, sir. Let your mighty hand that helps, that delivers, that reviews, that resurrects the dead, that provides, and that makes it way that there is no way. That got water from the rock. Join that lady and that gentleman. We thank you, Father. For the glory and the honor, we give them back to you. Lord. We go our Father, come and be manifest. We go our Father, come and be manifest. You have the word of life. Father, come and be manifest. We welcome your presence. We welcome your grace. The glory and the honor, we give them back to you. Lord. In Christ Jesus, and all say the name. Love for Him mightily. Love for him mightly. As you thank him. As you thank him. Before you see it, I request those seated at the back. If it's possible with you, we draw closer this way in front. If it's possible, we draw closer this way. Take the first place. You are the honorable person. You are the great person that we prepared for. No other one. You are our chief guest. We welcome your friends. Thank you for coming this evening. This is Eden Miracle Ministries. We are led by a man of God. Our friend and our father. Pastor Joseph Sexaka. And he sends you greetings. And Mama Thala Sexaka. And the whole family. Entirely. And all the pastors of Eden send you greetings. 
your faith. We honor you, our friends. Those who gather in the mornings and the evenings. Thank you for coming. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hey. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Greet your neighbor. No kwagara kwa Kristo. With the love of Christ. Mumbulizeko. Greet them on my behalf. Mwanize mukwira uko akatonda. Welcome them in the presence of God. Mukama agenda tukola bulonje. God is going to do us good. Amanya gangeze Tamale John. He is Pastor Tamale John. Ndi muweleza mu chifo chino. I'm a minister in this place. Ndi musajja mufumbo. I'm a married man. Omuchalo munga mukazi. One woman who is a woman. Na abana mukaga bedu. And six children. Mukama to Koseburunji. God has done us good. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I am Mokisa Charles. Mm -hmm. I'm a married man. Ah. Married to Helen. Yes. With eight children. Amen. Gamba Rabbi Mirida. Why? Those who are standing today, Basaja. they are men. We are men. Do not joke with us. The Nazarabasatu. I had three at trio. Triplets. And I've been having one after another. Hallelujah. Amen. He had three at the time. And I've been pushing one after another. Amen. <laughs> Amen. 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 We welcome you, my friends. You know, laughing is also a medicine. We come in the house of the Lord to join. Hallelujah. Amen. You can laugh and get delivered. Amen. Those who have seen that the men who deal with the spirit of the Lord always. They always tell us laugh. Hallelujah. Amen. Laughing. It's a sign of the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. 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 It's a sign of the Holy Spirit. So we thank God who has given us the grace. And then we came. Bring forth our theme tonight. I want us to get enough time to pray. What the Spirit of the Lord has put on my heart. And I assure you, it's the word you've been seeking for. And that's the reason why God brought you. The Bible said God sends His word. And He comes to heal us. And even today's evening, I assure you that God has sent His word unto a man and a lady. But I pray, if this word was sent to a man or a woman, I pray that let that be you. If there is anyone God prepared to meet them through this word, I pray that let that be you. Say, Father, let it be me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I want to talk about what I refer to Building as. your spiritual capacity to possess your possessions. Building my capacity, spiritual capacity, to make my spirit heavy enough to having the strength of the spirit to be able to possess those things that were prepared for me by God. I told you, brethren, every man and every woman who came on this earth and your spirit was released by God left the heavens and came on the earth. It came when it had its inheritance or heritage. And the Bible says, We are here together with Christ. So the problem about God has never refused to give us our possessions. And all the things God gave them to us. But the problem about it is why do we find ourselves most of the times we have not been able to possess which are our possessions. Praise the Lord. 
somebody dies and gets back into heaven without being able to touch on that blessing or what was promised that's when the Bible says there are people who died in expectation with the hope and they saw things are far off but they died without touching them you said that is not me I won't die while anything I will not die just seeing them from afar. I'm supposed to touch them. We even broke the law of Dobi Kwatako. Where is the problem coming from? A person breaks the law of Dobi Kwatako and they continue not to have them and they fail not to touch them. The Spirit of the Lord gave me this word three weeks back a week is that I shared it with these people. If you read the book of Obadiah 117 to do came sin. let's rush and get there. Obadiah mm. is the one who 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 is the Bible says upon mountain Zion, on the mountain of Eden, there shall be people be delivered. You need to be a holy one. And the house of Pastor Tamale John will possess their possessions. All of it, but say it. Take away in your young. Put down my name. Gamma and you may have John. Say, and the house of Mukisa Chance. In no Kiras in Jim. This house is rebellious. I told you to put there the pastor's name. May you have a clap for yourself. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Say in the name of Jesus. It is written upon Mount Bolivar. There shall be people to be delivered. It will be holy. In the house of Makisa Charles shall possess their possessions. Those were not written down to fill up the book. Your house ought to be possessing their possessions. When you read the whole of the Bible, all the people who have been moving with God, God has been making them take their heritage. And these promises were not put in place for us to just read about them and leave the world without touching any of them. God wouldn't have promised if he knew that I was not going to be able to touch them and he would not give them to me. So brethren, everything that you need on the earth, God unleashed it already and gave it to you. I already sell the one against. I don't demand anything from God. All that I need, he already gave it to me. Should I show it to you? Mama, so ma. You read it for us, Mama. Ephesians. Abefeso. Chapter 1, verse 3. Abefes. I'm going to show you where the problem crops from. And where our battle will be waged from today's evening. So, Mama. Mama. Abefeso Suremu Orinyoroksatu. Yeba Zibwe. Katonda Chitai Wamukama Face Christo. Ea Tua. Bulimukisa Gwona Ogomo. Ea Kolatia. The Baba has not said that he, he will oh, give us tua. or who is going to give us. Bible the Bible has said who has blessed us at what day I learned a little English. It has helped me. A person that you have not blessed becomes a blessing. Take so Bible Gambia, who has blessed us? At what day? It is already given to us. That's what it means. It's not just going to be given to us. We are already blessed with every. Nabuli. 
No, you understand them the right Nebo way. Gamba every. Bo gamba burichi. Chitegezaji. Biona. Burichi netaga. All that you need. Buri mukisagwe netaga. Every blessing you saw need. O musajono. This man. Yamalo guri rising. He released it already. With every spiritual blessing. Na buri mukisagwe no guomu oyo. In heaven places. O kuvambi febi omu guru. Kakati abolu ganda. So now brethren. O busiburi wano. This is where the problem is. O mukatuli chia gamba. A Catholic says. Di katonda mu oyo muerere. That God is just a spirit. Tainachi. And has not. Wanji. Wala. Tainachi. Doesn't have what? Irayensonga luachi. And that's the reason why. Nchi omukisaguli in the spiritual form. No, the blessing omukisaguli mchukula cha muoyo. Teguli in the physical form. Te, it's not in mukukwa tika koku no kwezi. Kuvanga mukama biyatuwa. For what God gives to us. Yatuwa in the spiritual form. He gives us mungeri ya muoyo. It's up to us who are in the physical world. To do whatever it takes. To see that this is spiritual blessing. How, how does it unveil and I possess it when it is physical yes, and tangible? That's the reason why. Every day you dream while you're counting money. You know what that means? In the spiritual, the money was given to you. Yes. That's the reason why you dream about the wedding every day. Before I left this place going to UK, I used to dream of America. I dreamt of America. But I'd never gone out of this country even going to Kenya. Here. The sign that proved God had given me the nations. The Bible says, Word, the word became a human being. Isaiah proclaimed the child. But the child he had proclaimed was Mungeri Yamoyo. And time came. The child was in the spiritual form. The blessing that was in the spiritual form of the Savior that was promised God from the spiritual form. And became a good part of the Bible. In the beginning was the Word. And the Word was with God. And the Word was God. 14. The same same chapter. Chigambo na fuko mubiri. Chigambo na kolatia. Na fuko mubiri. Who in the beginning was the word? See, mulebere mulebere yari wari wa chigambo. Mungo mwana wari. Then the son was there. O mungu ono nga wari. This person was there. Nenga ali mu spiritual form. But nga ali mu chikula cha moyo. O roku banze ni mu physical form. Because since I am in the physical, mu chikula cha mubiri. I am physical. I cannot see the other child in the physical. That's why I see the things in the spiritual form. I dream while I'm driving. I dream while out in the nation. I dream while after building. I dream while counting money. But when I get back into the physical world, I wake up when I don't have anything. Those who are counting dollars in the world. I used to count the money always. Physical money is painful. The spiritual money is painful. That is so painful. When the landlord is demanding you, you get banned of school dues. You have nothing to feed on your home. You get a dream while you're counting banders and putting them aside. You wake up when you don't have even a coin on you. I used to feel like I needed to get back into the other room and ask God to bring it back. At least rest and have a night in that world. But when you have gotten from there, I want us to this evening. May God empower your spirit with the ability to bring that that was in the spirit. Let it be seen physically. That blessing must come in the physical form. And it comes down in the physical form. The man Eliezer 
where he went to bring Isaac as and he told the in of Isaac God has blessed my master with all the physical blessings physical blessings when the blessing that God told about Eliezer in the spirit of him, Eliezer was giving a testimony for this. That the blessing is abound. You look for it there. Even that at the purpose. And the Lord has it. blessed my, my master with Every physical blessing. The Bible the Lord has blessed us. The Bible has said here, Every spiritual blessing. Now bless brethren. Oh, Mukis Sogo go go moyo. That blessing that was spiritual. I want it to physical. Togenda zimba nyumba muguru. You not build a house in heaven. Mugu togenda fumbiru wa yombaga. You not have a wedding in heaven. Teri kuzara baana. That is nothing like having children in heaven. In, um, in heaven there is no America. Praise the Lord. Wanji. Hello. In heaven, have no building, you raise up. No. But the Lord has blessed my master greatly. There is an, blessing. A, 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 Hards, silver and gold, men and female servants, camels and donkeys, all this is talking about a physical. The donkeys and the camels is talking about are not in the dream. The silver and gold he talks about are not in the dreams you always receive. They are tangible, tangible. Praise the Lord. Gamba ai mukama. Se oga. Yamba zomwe yokuanga ama. Empower my spirit. Sobolo kusika yebi. That I can bring down that thing. Omuki sago wampa. The blessing you give to me. Ogubat dem ifebi awa. That was in heavenly places. I want to bring it down to this evening. So now, brethren, I was reading there and then I feared a little. The Bible says that He has blessed us in the heavenly places. Oh. Let me show you where the battle rages on. Read Ephesians chapter 6 and verses 12. Ababefese the spirits of wickedness in the spiritual world. The Bible said God has blessed us. The blessing he has given to us is in the heavenly places. And the devil knew it. First read it. Abefese Sulemu Olinyoroksatu. Yeba ziwe katonda chitayu wa mukama wa face Christo. Ea tuwa buli mukisa guwono guwo moyo. Mubifebio muguru. In the heavenly places, the when the devil gets to know that this blessing that was given to you is in the heavenly places, he fashions his demons in the heavenly places also. Why do they reign in the heavenly places? Because the blessing that was given to you, the Bible has said, with every spiritual blessing in the heavenly places. Now read it again in the chapter 6, verse 12. Kubanga tetume gana, tetume gana. 
What do you think the battle that God talks about? What wrestling and we wrestle for? Blessing. Mukisa. Blessing. The devil says You will not touch it Even though it was promised to you And up in the heavenly places where it was put I put there my giant to fight I put there my men Who will not allow you to bring down the blessing But you say in the name of Jesus These people are not here Bring a king a person who brought a blessing, you come to get a blessing. Like this. Yes. In the name of Jesus, the Spirit of God, give me the power and authority that I can bring down those previous parties. The previous parties that are holding my blessings in the heavenly places. God released the blessing already. The wedding was released by God. Don't demand it from him. I don't demand money from God anymore. I'm not demanding any wealth from him. The Bible says he gave it all to me. But they are in the heavenly places. But there are these people that the, God, the Bible talked about who reign in the heavenly places. You'll ask them about Daniel. God tells him the day you began to prepare your heart to come at the boulevard for a prayer I released what you wanted to pray from me but for 21 days when something that God released there was a mighty one who was holding it <laughs> It took a wedding of a war for the heavens to get involved. For the blessing of Daniel to be saved. You say in the name of Jesus. I also rise the heavens to get involved in for my possessions. But against if you don't fight, praise the Lord. If you don't fight, you can live the life of this world the way you were brought. Praise the Lord. You can leave this earth when the promises you've only said them. It was written. I will be a blessing in the city. Are you a blessing real? <laughs> you get here with 7,000. Meka? 7,000. And you use it to buy food? You have been in the city from morning and you have not earned anything. And now you have 1,800. That's how you are getting back home. There's somebody who wanted the city. Well dry. And they have left it dry. What does this mean? That God lied out. Was God just saying what he didn't understand? That we shall build houses and reside in them. You can confess it. But you die while renting. There is a battle of bringing down the blessing. Bring it down from the heavenly places. That's the reason why I was telling you. It is a must. Very important. For us to build our spiritual capacity. Our spiritual muscles. Paul has told us. There is a wrestling. Not by the blood and the blood. But he has talked about powers here. About for them, you repeat them. Want to say them. But my reason is why do we wrestle? The devil has no battle with you. Get born again. You remain poor without getting married. When you become a reproach, just get born again and be a beggar. And when you're a vagabond and begging, there's no problem with you. 
But the problem abound is you beginning to demand the promises and the blessing. That's the reason why if you have not started on the issues of the weddings, the spiritual spouse will not attack you or maybe he has not seen anything or a blessing on the way. The dead cannot arrive. The Bible says Dawoodi. David, when he was anointed to become king of Israel, all the Philistines arose to attack David. My question is, while David is shepherding the flocks on the world, why didn't the Philistines arise against him? While he was there dealing with the cow while having that sack order of an animal. Because they really have the same order like that of an animal. Because they spend days with him. This man was a shepherd. Of the sheep and the flocks of his father. While having the same order of those animals. While waking up to go out into the world. You Philistines where were you? Why didn't they arise? The Philistines can be ancestral spirits. It can be a freezing spirit. It can be a dead person. It can be a sorcerer that was made not to use money. When you don't have the money as if it doesn't exist. You have to begin to claim you want to receive money. You will see a problem. That's why our father tells us. He says, if you wake up one day and get out of there, and you say, Oh, Jaja, these issues of Jesus I give up, I've come back, uh, that's where the battles will stop. <laughs> that's where the battles will stop. And they'll say, Leave alone the grandchild. If you tell the demons that you're doing out with the holy matrimony, let me just be taken just like that. Tomorrow you'll get married. And even today's evening. <laughs> they can even drum for you and clap for you. I'm telling you the no, truth. You say now let the hard come. They will bring him so easily. And you'll even have a Mercedes Benz. Hmm? That you're going to be wedded in Eden. A wedding with a knot. There there is a problem. And there is a battle waged on. There is a wrestling. Tell your neighbor. Touch them. You will not scare me so much. No, 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 no. no. Tell the neighbor. Today's evening. We didn't come here to intercede. We came to wrestle. Paul said because. Don't we intercede? What does he say to Mama? For we do not wrestle. Uh -huh. With the blood and flesh. The Bible says. When they said free Daniel. One of the principalities held the angel. Who was holding and saying you will not go. They praise you. For 21 days. Daniel wanted the blessing to come down. And the spirit stood in its midst. There is somebody here. You were supposed to get wedded. The holy matrimony. 15 years ago. You wouldn't have slapped mama. There's somebody here. You were supposed to leave this country 25 years ago. You would even be having the children you have now. They would be Canadians. You were supposed to have your children in Canada. God released the visa 25 years ago. But it, something held it. Now 25 years. You are in Uganda. 
Promotion is John Onya. The promotion he is seeking. Eh, inzo kumanga yamuaka guwede. Maybe it was for last year. Yes, so God watch him come up. Kula gana kapa ne nobirota. That's the reason why God gives you a sign, and you even dream about them. Musumba naro sense. Pastor, I dreamt of grasshopper. And fruits. Gandi mu mu mi yembe jenge dead. While I was having red mouths. You had that dream five years ago. Kari kapa ne da kala ga. It was a sign to. Prove to you that the harvest is ready. Up to now, maybe they even got rotten. How many of us have ever dreamed about that? You dream of the fruits. You dream of grasshoppers. It is your season. That's why I always tell Bonagains. When you dream of the Dead. You run very fast to come to the pastors. You run fast to get into dry fasting. But let them dream of ripe mangoes. That they take it to be no more. Now me, I got to know. With the dead, I don't arise so much. Let me dream of mangoes. That's where my battle is. I tell you the truth. For why? I want the power and the energy you give to the devil when you dream of the dead. Double it. When you have dreamt about your season due. Because seasons have been lost. We have lost them. We are laying in the church. We have called all the fires on the earth. But we have remained with empty hands. So today's evening, we need to agree with the ability. We need to put on spiritual sins so that God can make a spirit healthy. We attack those who make them lose our blessing. Whatever that was bound in the scripture, shine it mine today. Praise the Lord. That's why Jesus tells us. Acts of the Apostles, chapter 1, verse 5. Up to the Let me show you. 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 Awe ba kungana, neba mubuza nga baga mbanti, mukama wafe, mubilo bino, mwono kumeza wa wakawa keri isi da hili. Kakati wano, now for this one, I got a revelation here. Bari ba mubuza mungeri endara. They were asking him in one way, is the time that has come for us to possess our possessions? Is it our right time to get the possessions? What does it mean? Naba gamba anti, si kwa mwe, ukumanye ntuko, ni wankuba debilo. Chitafe biyateka, mubu inza buwe inza buwe inza buwe inza buwe inza buwe. Muri webu amani. Muri kora mutiya. Muri webu amani. Muri webu amani. But you will receive power. Uh huh. Omoyo mtu kuvu. Bali malo kujaku mui. Uh huh. Namu muna banga ba juli rwa banga. Simanyo wuri da Yesu chaba gamba. I think you hear what Jesus tells them. Omoyo kubagu funo buso bosi neemba. When your spirit attains the ability, capacity, and the strength. That means it can fight for its own. And overcome the enemy. And make the enemy lose your position. Yeah. Tells them when you attain this power. What happens next? Witnessing for my name. You cannot witness. When your spirit. Is still weak. I will still born again. We deal with the two The physical realm and the spiritual realm. But the realm that makes most means that we must look after and care for so much is the spiritual realm. Now where the problem is that the physical realm we give it a lot of time. The physical realm we care for it so much. This person of the flesh we have fed him so much. We cared for him so much. More than the other one, the other person Jesus speaks in the book of John chapter 6 6 and 3. Talking about 
remember these two words. The physical realm and the spiritual realm. Jesus shows you the word that That you must care for that that makes me. You can't sell a mukaga or you can't kaga mesiato. Omo yo gwe gule tobula mo. Omo yo gwe kukola kutia. Gwe gule tobula mo. Uh huh. Omo bi te guli koche gugasa. Omo bi te guli koche gugasa. The flesh profits nothing. Omo bi go take a mo di chukumi. The flesh where you put every coin of yours. Yes, we are going to gugasa. Jesus has said it profits nothing. Arrest the people. Before you apply lipstick in the physical realm, first apply lipstick in the spiritual realm. Before you get the breakfast of the flesh, first get the breakfast of the spirit. Before you get lunch of the spirit, first feed your spirit. That's why the Bible says like our physical is getting finished off. But our inner person gets renewed every day. Paul shows you that the inner person every day gets his news. When the as news is spiritually getting in life, let me tell you to run in unless you have become a spiritual giant. The Bible says we are against the principalities and the authorities and the rulers and the spirits of the enemy in the heavenly places. And the heavenly places. That's where your wedding is. That's where the child is seeking for is. That's where the job is seeking for is. That's where the wealth is seeking for is. And the one God was blessing us the Bible says, he put it in the heavenly places. And in the heavenly places that's where with these people are that we talked about. Kakati ate now. Mukama yakuwa gwe obuyin sa eko chona chukuwa. God gave you the threat and gave that to you. Nga gori no kuwa no rutalo. It's you to wage the war. O kuwa kani o kuwa kani debiyo. To fight for your possessions. Bible ye gamba mat matayo kumi ne mu kumi na bili. The Bible says in the book of Matthew eleven twelve. Look at him sin. Get there very fast. Matayo sura kumi ne mu olinyore kumi ne bili. O kuva kumi na biyo kano mubatiza. O kuva di. O kuva kumi na biyo kano mubatiza. O kutu salero. O kutu sadi. Salero. Bible ye gamba mecha boluganda. What does the Bible say, brethren? Zen na baga muda kugera salero. I told you today you have to speak. Mumu lozamu muda kunti satis. If you think that you'll scare off me. Gamba kutu sadi until kutu salero until today. Leronga meka today when is the date? Gabiri munya on the twenty fourth. Gabiri mubiri ogwadi on the twenty second D of November of which year? Gabiri mwe satu twenty twenty three. From the days of John the Baptist until now, at this very minute we are here. Jesus says, "What is that?" The kingdom of heaven has suffered violence. What is that that we take violently? What is that? Which means there is a battle. Jesus has waged it. If you are take possession of the kingdom, the premises of the kingdom of God, the wealth of the kingdom of God, the blessing of the kingdom of God, when the wedding is of the kingdom, money that is of the kingdom of the God, Jesus has said, there is a breaking through violently. Why does he talk about kuwaguza? Which means there are giants who claim you'll die like your forefather. Like father, like son. Hey! Yes. When I knew this, now, I care so much about my spiritual realm. That's why you see me. I passed the Tamale John. I no longer enjoy East on the Earth. I no longer enjoy Christmas. On the 25th, that's when I get into my fasting season. You are now uh, uh, expecting good food. The 
chicken duck. I'm not the big preparing where I'll go for those days. And those days, even when you ask my wife, I'll all take them out of home. And all the children, they come back on the second. <laughs> Those are my days of being set apart. Those are my days of being set apart. Those are my days of putting on the sneers spiritually. And last year, it was very interesting that first thing season worked for me. I think on the 29th, I had a dream the doctors had come and they were injecting me with a booster injection and I knew my spirit has been boosted up spiritual immunity you I was ministering here last Monday. Somebody got a vision in the congregation and told me, Pastor, I've been ministering. An arrow came while you're targeting your herd, but it hit and fell off. Wow. If I had a weak spirit, when my spirit was weak, those are the issues you find that somebody fell sick, you heart attack two days and they are demised. I beseech you, you're going to get your possession. First, build the muscles. Fill your spirit in God. Care the spiritual rim like never before. It is easy to get to know what is in your spiritual rim. The dreams that you receive. I always tell the one again. Whatever God is going to do in your life is going to best. On the condition of your spirit. State of your spirit. What to see Why do you have to put on the capacity? I'm going to show you in the list. I want you to note this one number two. I want you to note this. Our possessions are in the enemy's hand. Over whatever you want to possess is already occupied. There is not any wealth you will find there on a silver platter. It was written. God, so you say it. You gave the evil job to heap up heaps. Yeah, you bring a heap. You bring bags here and make a heap here. Bugs here. You bring a heap there. You put their hips. It was written. God gives the wicked to heap up a heap. Let me raise a question. How many of us here the, the years you have spent for years? That you found 100 million is over there. And you picked. How about two millions? How about ten millions? How about one million? I'm 46 years of age. I've ever, never found 25. There's money that can't fall. You find 10,000? 2,000? A coin of five. Those who dump a lot of money. 50,000. Yes. Brother, is the hippies. But the hippies. When they said those to the hippies, they are not ready to go. We are just going to break them to get this hip from them. The wedding is abound. But it is in the hand of the enemy. The visa is already there. But something guards it. That you have to break through violently to get where the blessing is. Isaiah 45, it scared me. When I read it, 
Nchagenda kwata kumukono gwe yafuka kama futa. That will take hold over hand of that one he anointed. Amukule mbere chisoka. And lead him the first thing. Aje mura mawanga agajema. Subdue nations. Mawanga chago. Which nation is? Bevali. They are the ones. When you have prayed for something for 10 years and it failed, that is the nation that is rebellious. After the nation, and then God says, I will lose. And then he will, I will take him and will give you and give you one million. Bugembe Pastor Bugembe. That even for someone to help you, God touches them first. Even the born against them are not ready to help you. There are those even who refuse when God spoke to them clearly. Some have come to me and they said, Pastor. There's somebody who came those days later and told me, Pastor. I was sitting over there. I had the money. God told me to give you that money. But I use the money first. Pray that God brings back the money. Which means even the good against they hear the voice. And they rebel. They've come three of them. Pastor, God told me to give you 200,000. And I had it. Pastor, but I used it. Pray for me. You will now begin to see. It begins to pass by the other side and you say, but me, I always tell them, no. It is not me who told you to give me money. The other one there. I have no problem with you. Hello? Even for the born against the heaven, to give you the spirit of the Lord first convicts them now about the minister. And those who convicts hear the voice and when they hear the word, they are those who are rebellious. Pastor told us that he has a friend pastor. Somebody bought a new vehicle. And God told him take that vehicle to and so and somebody rebelled. Drove it and it became a wreckage. After it is all he brought it. And he said, Pastor, God told me to give you the vehicle when I just left the bond. But, 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 but. but the one he brought was already out of the correct yes, conditions and it would go down. After he drove it and it is old. What is that? There are nations God must subquatter. Touch your neighbor. So maybe you are the nation with my possessions. God is going to subdue me tonight. In my possessions. Hello? Gamba aye mukama. Goro mukono go. Stretch out your mighty hand. Oje muda muri guanga. Subdue every nation. Eri nevi ang. Na has my possessions. Bieta gechiro chari. I need them tonight. Bible ne gamba mbu amana oje muda mawanga te. The Bible says that the subduing nation. He found the crooked places. Hey. Yes. You see the work that is abound. Where are we going, God? The Bible says what comes next. I'm going to break the agula You read. Okugula Okugula I'm in Isaiah 45 years. Read. Ndi sumulevi watu Okugula wenzi jimu masoge. Mm -hmm. Nezi wankachi. Teziga renga u. Mm. Ndi kule mbela. Nenteleze vifebi talibi sende. Uh -huh. Ndi menyame nyezi jeze vikomo. Sima nyo uri ya uruta ururi yao. You hear the battle that is with there. Wali wama wanga akaji. There are nationalists that will be there. Look at the places. Ebi febi talibi sende. I'll break little pieces the gates of bronze. Na menyanga nyezi jeze vikomo. And cut the bars of iron. Ate menye. Abaye vitu minani ya visimba. Who put these things in the place? Who put there these gates of bronze? And these bars of iron that God says is going to break them. What is that behind these bars of iron? So my mama. Read. Ndime nyame nyezi jezebi komo. Nente mateme bisibebi ebi uma. Aha. Erandi kuobu gaga obomu chizikiza. Sima nyo ulira. Waliobu gaga. That is treasure. Wealth. 
That is your wealth, but it is in the deep bowels of darkness. And put on to it gates of bronze and chains of iron. There are metal bars there. And even the way that goes there, there are nations where the Devil said that you are So, brother, this is what God says. I'm going to empower your spirits. Amen. I'm going to make it heavy. And then you attack. And be able to own your heritage. Mako, Satwa, Bidim Musam. Mark 3. Mako, Isura Satu, or Nura Bidim Musam. Neo tewali muntu, ainzo kuingira mu nyumba yo muntu wa amanyi. Uh-huh. Okunyaga ebintu bye. Yes. Ngatasose kumusiba. Uh-huh. Nalyo kanyaga nyumba ye. Che nkugambiye. It is that I told you. Bana abakuru entumo bebaga mu kutuma entumo. This that they were told to make a heap. Ate bai begamba ba amanyi. The Bible says they are strong. Che gambiye. That's what I told you. Whatever you want to possess. Buli chona cha galo kwetu alira. Is already possessed. Jina nyini cho reda chukute. Tewali sere zo genda kusanga kumukeka. There is no money you'll find on a silver platter. Say yeah young and say yeah say yeah young and say yeah young and say yeah say How many of us have sailed off? Let me tell you even getting into the heavens. If your forefather never entered it, he says, My grandchild, you must come to the heaven. There's a battle. As the spirit of lasting comes and invades you, you are, the enemy will arise and people hate them and make you fail to get to heaven. Even the heaven is itself entering there, it's breaking through. The temptation is that it makes you to fail to go to heaven are very many. You can't just go sailing off through like that. Unless maybe this one in the Mokono. But there is also traffic jam here. You can't just go through just like that. Great. Jesus said, No one goes to a house, to a house and be able to pick anything. Unless when they first bind them. My question now is who can bind the strong man? The one who is stronger than them spiritually. That weak spirit you always dream when it gets back into the game. When the spiritual power uses it seven times in the night, it cannot attack the house of a strong man. That's why I still the born again. First get to rest about some issues. You first work on your spirit. Jesus has told that the spirit makes meaning. The moment the spirit gets to a capacity, the spirit is delivered. The spirit is leading. I told you what is in the spiritual realm. Is what appears in the spirit, physical realm. When the spirit is sick, hate it like it. The, spirit, the flesh will also fall sick. And some people will even sit there. You have the sickness in your body. You have gone to every doctor and every hospital. And they tell you you are okay. But when you feel you are getting finished off. Whenever you go for diagnosis and to get Just get to know. It's not a physical disease. It is the spirit that is sick. The moment the spirit falls sick. How many of us here have ever received the dream? And it comes into perfection the way it was. You dreamt about a sick person. You dreamt about a dead person. You dreamt about an accident. You dreamt when somebody was getting married. You dreamt when somebody had built a building on a Kampala road. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And I built it. You dreamt of a dead person and he died. Things he begin in that room. When the spirit is still poor. Even when I give you a lorry full of money physically. 
Number one, the deliverance we seek for here is not physical. We have come to make our spirits get delivered. Those who are here two weeks back, I showed you. The way we come to church when we get born again. It's like you saw Lazarus got resurrected. Jesus goes to the grave where Lazarus was buried. He had been buried for four days dead. Jesus did whatever he did and called him back to the grave. The Bible says the one who was dead came out from the grave. But it came out with the garments of the dead. From the grave. They were not left in the grave. That's the reason why. When you got born again and came to the church, the garments of your father's house of rejection of poverty of what you them. The Bible says, while well, still dead in our sins, Jesus rose us. I, I heard pastors who ministers. Who tells born against that there is nothing like Okusumulula? That means you don't read the Bible. You who tells people that there is no deliverance, you don't read the Bible. You have not perceived the things right. You get the book of John. This is how you got born again in 43. You got born again and got resurrected again. But then your spirit came when it was in which state? This is the spirit. Yes. Uh -huh. Yes. Come forth. Do you know that you also heard a voice of the preaching? Even when you got born again, the there are people when it was a dream. And they told you go to Pastor Sex Circle's church. Get born again. Some of you are at the crusade, some of the radio the voice the Lazaro, vayo. He spoke with the voice and said, Lazarus, come out. Lazaro. Come, Lazarus. We nakatude. You nakatude. You had the voice and you came out. Uh -huh. okay. You are now good and bad again. Hey. Hey. He he still has a cloth. He has come out from the grave. He has come out from the grave. But on him there are garments. The spirit is being garmented still. I used to do myself while putting on the all the time, the days I dreamt while putting on three garments. Pastor Tamale John, I never received even a coin. I didn't do anything in my life until I was so impressed. I never became anything in that time. The time when I dreamt when I'm putting on rags. I had gotten born again. But I was still putting on the garments. But while wrapped up in Gazingi Domumbugo, Amaguru Nemikono, Nechiremba, Gatsibidom, Mumaso, Nechiremba, Gatsibidwa, Mumasoge, Mumasoge, that message is so big. Nayomo Kubango, Mutoku Sibidwa, but if your head is wrapped, O Mutoku Kuria, Matua Gauri, the Voziriamukam, it is on the head that you have the ears that hear the voice of God. Kuria Masa Garaba, it is there where you have the eyes that Kuria Kamua, that's where the mouth is. Yes, That's why some of you get dreams. When something is strangling you. You want to speak the name of Jesus, it can't come out. The mouth is bound. Physically, you speak. But when the inner person, the one who profits and brings life, let me tell you, God does not hear this physical voice of the flesh. Your spirit is what God hears.
Tatuuliza matuka na gomu hoyo Kariya matuwa gomu hoyo Those inner ears Geka uri eto wazili amu kama Are the ones that hear the voice of God Kati ate ngamba nyaba lokole Now I always tell the man again Nchiwa muke sagona That the end blessing Kutandika na matu Begins with the ears if you diligently hear the voice who hears what hears Lazarus has gotten resurrected from the grave but the head is bound what else was bound in Mikono the hands and the legs were bound the devil seeks for three parts of your spirit your head spiritually those who were out yesterday in the general we were with the battles of the heads and the legs that were amputated first beheads you and then takes off the eyes you can have the eyes it blocks your ears what makes you eat your teeth? The ears are blocked. Huh? What makes you hate the person without forgiving them? You hear the voice that tells you forgive. You are going through seven days of dry fasting. When you have three people bound on your heart and they're claiming you can't forgive them. Jesus said, when you come to pray, first forgive. You got the mountain. Seven days dry fasting. What a waste. Stay home, eat your food. If you fail to forgive, righteousness is failing. David said, even when I have forgotten the Lord, but inside of me there is unrighteousness, you would not hear me. I would just waste time. We wasted times and seasons. The ears are blocked. God has made me dream many people while tied to the hands the back, while chained. Why do you think things are not moving? For 10 years you have not taken even two steps forward. Why is it that even their beginnings and you did not progress? You have not gone forth. The spiritual feet are bound. The devil seeks for the spirit to make you fail. And God also seeks for the spirit to deliver you. Now I want to request you to beseech you. Care so much about the spirit more than the body. Give much time to your spirit more than your flesh. There are born again who go to church on Sundays. For you to get the Bible and read it, you open it well here at Bolivar. They even put it for you here. Screen. You no longer open the Bible. <laughs> you read the one on the screen. Praise the Lord. Before you put a comb and lipstick and lip shine and a mirror into your bag, put their Bible first. Forget the phone at home. But you shouldn't forget the Bible. So now God helped us. And he gave men the, the wisdom of the brute technology. There are those that we call Bibles. You can put it on your phone. And you hear the psalm. Whenever you're hearing the psalm, your spirit is being built and eating. Draw with the tic-tac. All those things that they have brought to defile our spirits. 
Dwell with YouTube. At least we are on YouTube when like these people sing listening to spiritual gospel songs. Watch the TV, but whatever you watch must be benefiting and profiting. That's what Paul tells us. Make meaning of your and even to those who And even the neighbors who hear it must benefit. But you talk about Mama Nakatude. I don't even finish that one. You talk about the shoe by the pastor. He was getting older. That coat he was putting on. But now this coat, how does it help your spirit? Born again. But the one you have enough on your plate. All of you seated over here. Kusowani yo kulike vikumala. We. We forget. Bera kuchicho. Eya musumba mukisha jiveku. This that concerns pastor mukisha. Mule karu anakai nebi bie nange ni nebi ange. Let him fight his issues. He has his issues also. I don't know the shoes that a pastor puts on. Sija kuri mba sizi manyi. I will not lie I don't know. And it's all that I do not know any. I see you that I am so keen to see the truth. Is, is that what brought me from my home? When I know the truth, with all the words it is, my brain is on the shelf. Who be wasting me? Who really buried me? I leave my place in Lunguja. When I come to see for the deliverance, I came here to the deliverance. I look at the, the hair of my sister, Matef. But that's hair I spent three months. I'm kind of looking at the hairstyle of somebody. Did I come here to see people's hairstyles? You put on the same dress for a I don't know what they have one. That's not what brings me here. Uh, I came to fight for my life. I get out of bondage. When they reverse me, I get to possess my possessions. Some of you swayed off the right track. We are in the church but laid. Our spirits are bound still on the chains. With the problems I have. With the six children I heard me talk about. In a time I have to pay eight million for fees. Now I come and make an evil prayer against the pastor Mukisa. I feel him. You will not cross over. How can that prayer help my children to have school deals? Huh? Already in the country. I'm already on the chains. And I look at some other person's chains. I'm fighting for myself, born against fight for yourself. Build our spiritual muscles. Gamba neighbor. Tell your neighbor. Get out of my plate. Yours is filled up. Praise the Lord. Let us hurry and get time to pray. I was telling you. Your spiritual weight. Will determine. The weight of glory. God will entrust it on you. That God entrusts on you. God cannot take a weak spirit. And then gives it a glory of blessing. 
Mukama kabera obusobozi bwo moyo bwo. God checks out the ability in the of his spirit. Then he descends on to give us whatever he gives. Yes, us. That's the reason why. Today you receive the Just get to know that mumoyo. That this is the weight. This glory you claim from God. God is God for the two. He sees the glory that you are worthy of it is that you can uphold. The people pray for weddings. But if your spirit is weak, it cannot uphold the spiritual holy matrimony. That God take a meeting. Your spirit will never sustain you. That's the reason why many have gone down backslidden. In there. And they've gotten into homosexuality. And got married to old people. Because the spirits were weak. Say, oh God. So First, make my spirit heavy. God wants your spirit to first attain that to be able to carry heavy things and great things. Once a wedding, once buildings, once glory. Because that's the preaching we found in the church. And it is that that you also so desire to hear. The moment I talk about your problem, you bless me. You're going to get married. Your wedding is for tomorrow. <laughs> You're going to get the visa stamp. But the spirit that is still in the village out there in the graveyard, can it have a holy matrimony? Can it carry wealth? I told you I had gotten stuck in Uganda. I was here holding on to God. Give me a visa. Give me a visa. Give me a visa. Give me a visa. I change the passport. I change the names. I was left in Uganda. Last, the last time when I changed the mindset and the intentions, I told you a chance came for me to get to America. We were 40 people. All things have been paid for. When it was two weeks, we got to the embassy. A group of 40 people. I had a dream. While in the plantation of coffee in our place. President Obama, Obama and, and President Obama came in the coffee plantation. In the village there at our place. Passport I asked for my passport while in the coffee plantation. And stamped in the visa stamp while in the coffee plantation. He shook my hands and told me thank you for coming to America. America. I welcomed you to America. I woke up. I want to tell you. 39 people went to America. Given visas of two years. I, the 40th, I remained in Uganda. With the whole group. The spirit is still there in the coffee plantation. I've gotten the visa in the 40th plantation, and you think I go to America? There's a water. I began to build the capacity of my spirit. I got a dream when I was leaving the village. I was fasting three days of dry fasting. I want to get from the village. I had discovered the spirit is over there. I mean, Kampala fighting to go to America. But the spirit is in the village. Uh -huh. <laughs> I had a dream when I was leaving the village in that village with my brothers. The group I was leading, I was in the front. I found all the dead from the maternal side making a roadblock on the way. The one was the eldest of my mother. And I, I was leading them as a professor in Makerere. He asked me and said, Do you think I died? The dead asked me why did the dream. He told me, You think I died? He came with the fury, he wanted to take out of me. I gave and I got out of it. Then I knew there is a battle here to get from this village for the spirit to come out. I went and waged the war. I called on the spirit of the Lord to empower me with the strength of the to escape. 
After two days, I had a dream. The way it was, I was leading my brothers, one on the front. I found that roadblock again. The dead were all paralyzed. They were like statues. I passed by. And I was the pickup of the 99 policemen. I found the second road block where we were getting the top of the road. And the dead were paralyzed also. When I got on the tarmac to take taxis to Kampala from the village. I found that there was a container. The one who was my mother was not died yet. Container. They had gathered the whole clan in the container. And they were shouting. I asked the one who was the mother in the tomb. She had not died yet. Now who died? She said, your uncle. The one who told me that he had not died. And now I realized the dead had died. Hello? I took a vehicle. I think I took a vehicle. And when I took a vehicle, I took a vehicle that was going to Luero. I said, I'm not going to Luero. I'm going to Kampala. I got a vehicle in the dream. In the dream. I didn't took a turn to the Kampala. Those that come to Kampala. I reached the first the accident corner. Of our the accident of around 100 vehicles. They were dead bodies all over. There was a fatal accident. You had nowhere to pass. I got out of the bus. I dumped dead bodies. And went by them. And so I got to Kampala. Hello? It was like after two months. My friend paid for me all the money shopping. With money and I left this country. I first got out from where. The Bible is this one. The Bible says it does not profit. The spirit that prophesies in the years. Say, oh God. Tonight. Empower my spirit. Give it the strength. That I can top down what bound me in the village. So I come out of the village. I get the ability to understand you. I can't. Yes. Say, oh Jesus, get me also out of there. And they also get out and get married. I told you I have a friend of mine who is in the US. The sister gave her my contact. The man had spent like two years in America. He even failed to pay the ticket that he borrowed. He got a job in the restaurant for the Indians in America. And was earning $300. And he could not get any savings. Not even to save the in Kampala for two years. When he gave me that password, I had to ask about the dream. Which dreams do you always receive? And told me past. Since I came to America, I dream while I'm in the village or on Kampala Road. I said, okay. You have never gotten to America. The spirit brings life. And the flesh profits nothing. The body went to America. The spirit was left in Uganda. You can't make meaning in America. When the spirit is in Uganda. The devil allows you to go. But when the spirit is chained up. You're in Kampala. The spirit is in Bomba. You're in Kampala. You dream when you're in Rio. Get to know there is a battle. My friends, we put into fasting and praying for two months. And we had to lay an altar. Hold on the heavens. Until when this man, after two months, he had a dream. The very shirt in which he got to the ground. And the bag and the phone and the shoes. He went with the phone and the screen was really broken. 
He dreamt himself while getting off the plane. Arriving at the way he went two years ago. He raised him, it was at five o'clock. I have arrived in America. And I said, You are finished now. And then I told him, You are finished. The speed that prophesies. Say, Oh God. Make my spirit escape from the places that do not prophesize. Put it where it is supposed to be. It's the spirit that profits. The body, the flesh profits nothing. With the body you walk, you hear, you can see. These issues of there is no money. There are people who see money. It is you who does not see money. Your eyes are blinded. If God would open your eyes today, in Kampala here, there are billions of money for you. There is a woman called Aga. After Sarah and Abraham chased her away, God, she got the desert and there was no water. The Bible says that the child began to faint. No war. Haga knew the child was there. in a distance. And took the child away. And put the child there. And she, left. she didn't want to see the child while dying. The Bible says. While she was sitting there crying because of the child. And God sent her name. And opened her eyes. Where she was crying from. There was a well. The well of war. In the tomatoes you trade in, there is wealth. That business trading in the cloud is a good It's not the problem with the job. It's not the problem with the pastor. pastor. Your husband doesn't have the problem. Those who cheated are not the ones with the problem. But they are. Open my spiritual eyes. And that I can see where my blessing is. It's going to be our prayer today's evening. God will open your eyes. You see where your well is. Some of you do not need to go to America. You don't need to go to Europe. I prayed for you today's evening. May God open your eyes. You see where your money is. Not all of us that will go to America. There are some of you God created you will become a nagaga here in Kampala. Here. Just hold on your eyes. Gamba imukama. Echiro charero. Tonight. Gura maso gange. Open my eyes. Ndabe. That I can see. Where my blessing and my possession are. Echon chukusabi dorwa. I pray for you that tonight. Ba agavanji wano. There are many haggas. When you are, that's where the blessing is. But when your eyes are blinded. When the woman you are seeking for is the one next to you there. The eyes are blinded. When what you ought to do for you to get rich is there but you cannot see it. May God open your eyes. Let's us hurry. Uh, benefits. We see a meganulo. About two of them. Of building your spiritual strength. Why do we? Benefits of spiritual of building your spiritual capacity. Number one. To zimbe you will build our spiritual strength for victory in battles. Life is a battlefield. And many have lost this battle of life. Simply because their spirits are weak. 
Men have lost it. Banji ba firido taruno. Bino biyo wuli yango wode mwa manyo ya gara gode yomo nsi. Is he here like you want to back, get backslidden? Otaru wadu kuyinze. The bat is heavy for you. Bible ye gama to unakurumu. The Bible says one day. Dawdi na arumbi bwa. David was under attack. Nebocha mayumba. And they burnt off the houses. Nebatuwa robu kaka na habana na habachara. Took out the wealth, the children and the wives. Dawdi na guwa mga man. David got weary. Na atura wansina akube miranga. He sat down and began to weep. Bannango enze sima yuwa ndo alirika. I don't know whether he passed a look. Bannange, bannange, bannange. Alo, 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 alo. The men said, but now you our king crying. What should we do? Bible the Bible says, Dawudi, David encouraged himself. And his spirit picked the strength and the capacity Mukama. in the Lord. Bible the Bible says, he inquired the Lord, should I attack? And now God told him now that your spirit is strong. And with the ability to attack. You will not find them, my friend. Shall I recover them? You will recover them. Yes. He encouraged himself. And he put on the abilities. He attacked the enemy. And overcame him. Ephesians told us we do not wrestle against the blood and blood, but with the principalities and the rulers and the evil spirits which means that have the power and the courage your spirits be strong be able to go against the enemy He's waiting for us in the heavenly place where our blessings also. Se Second Corinthians 10, verse 3. We need to pray how to get there. Esula kumi, kuri nyo roku satu. Kubane wankuba de, nga tutambulida momobidi. Yes! Teturana kugobedida momobidi. Teturana tolu wa momobidi. Kubango mwrebe siwa momobidi ya tulu wanyis. For the enemy who fights us is not kano. Kubange miyo kuranyi sebi entalo za fe, sibi ya momobidi. Nebi ya maanyi, mokatonda, uroku menye ebigo. Uroku menye ebigo. Nga tu menye mpaka. Nga tu menye mpaka. Na bulichintuwe chiguru mivu. Yes. Echikulu mba zibwa, okuluwa nano kutegera kwa katonda. Kwa katonda. Yeranga tuje mula ulichiro wozo kulia kristo. kristo. Nga tume nye mpaka. As we cast out arguments. Wakana. There are things that are arguing. That claim. Cheva itabu fumbo. What they call marriage. Bifeko. Give up. Cheva itabu gaga. What they call wealth. Bifeko. Give up. Kuzara. Giving back. Bifeko. Give up. It is against you for 40 years. It claims you but you say tonight the spirit of God empower my spirit pour onto it with your power the Holy Spirit embrace my spirit join up with my spirit empower it so that I can break the action of that spirit that contend with my issues there is the contentment that we must break tonight Born again. I want to say this. Before the end of this year, those hands of yours should be able to touch something. I want to proclaim and prophesy that as our God lives, those hands of yours should not finish this year when they are empty. May God empower your hands and the strength and the grace and anointment to be able to represent things before the year gets over. Gentlemen receive something. Lady touch something that you can have a hit that you make the enemy lose. That's why David is saying that God he has empowered my hand to fight the battle. Tonight 
Jesus. I pray for you. May the spirit of the Lord empower your hands. To, to put down what you want. Overcome whatever overcame you. Be able to receive your possession. And as our God lives. The the man and the woman who breaks through to you. There is nothing in the grace that genuine life. Somebody breaks through to you. Somebody is empowered and given the grace. The Bible says Jesus said you will be given the power when the Spirit comes upon you. Say, Spirit of God, join me tonight. Join me tonight. Say, Spirit of God, fall upon me with your power. When Samson was born, the Spirit of the Lord, you fall upon him. And the cold is that upon him. You fall upon him with your power. And the chain is broken. The cord is broken. Say, oh Holy Spirit, fall upon me with your power. Tonight, embrace my spirit. Oh, the cord is broken. The chain is broken. You are the ancestor spirit. Oh, maternal spirit. The cord is broken. 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 Say, oh God. You said in your word. It will not be by power. Not authority. It will be your spirit. Say, spirit of God. I also welcome you. Join me tonight. This battle of redeeming my blessing and by the spirit of God. I'm going to possess my possession by the spirit of God. I'm going to break down by the spirit of God. I'm going to overcome that that had overcome me. In the name of Jesus. Second Samuel 22 verse 40. Those with envelopes give them out. We're going to give in. And we shall use up this time to pray. For you have armed me with the strength for battle. Mm. For you have armed me with the strength for battle. You have subdued under me those who rose against me. I want tonight. May God arm you with the power to fight. And because of that power, you can put down that kitambo. That kitega spirit. That me. That spirit. Spirit of power is overcoming you. The power of the Holy Spirit. The moment that has failed in you. You break it down tonight. This is where your God is saying. I'm going to put your enemies under your feet. I pray for you tonight. In the power of the Holy Spirit. God overcome for you something. And put it under your feet. May God overcome for you the Spirit that made you a failure. The Spirit that made you poor. That the man you play, that that bound your possessions, that that was against, that was suspicious, the maternal spirits, the entertainment of the man, may God overcome for you that Satan, put him under your feet, in the name of Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord. God is going to empower us. We are going to set the spirit of the Lord. To empower us. How do we get empowered? baptism. Jesus. John baptized with water. For repentance. But the time is coming. I'm going to give you my spirit. I'm going to baptize you with the spirit and fire. And be about to overcome and battle. Tonight. We need to set Jesus. To baptize us. 
Samson yeta lozo naze ya wangula. All the battles Samson overcame. Bible ye gama ncha omoyo wamo kama namu guwako na amanyi. The Bible says that the spirit of the Lord fell upon him mightily. Echi muche, echi tu amba za amanyi no kufune mbafu no busobozi. One of what makes us get the power and the strength and the ability is when we get baptized with the spirit of the Lord. Echi na kwe kusaba no kusiba. And I think it's the praying and fasting. Yesu agamba wali webi mu. Jesus says there are some things that will never be taken away. That will never be taken away. Okuja komu ntunga asabi na asabi. Unless when somebody fasts and prays. The times we are in. Born again is never allowed to be commanded. Get out from this common fasting season. They then say 28 days of fasting and then you trust. Get into your fasting and praying. Because of the situation that is before you. When you have not gone to say that the situation is coming out. When you are saying to God. Baptize me. Empower my spirit with ability. And you make it strong. That I can overcome the enemy. A spirit that is strengthened and capacitated. The Bible says the enemy runs off when no one trails them. When my spirit is still weak. I used to dream when the cats are chasing me around the house. <laughs> When it was a capacity and the strength and the cats chased me. Would you see me from a fan run off? Where was the difference? The spirit had dressed up with the fire. We need to know. May Jesus baptize the spirit with fire. No spouse can speak to me. When the spirit is dressed up with fire. When the spirit is perceiving. When it has the revelation of the power of the Bible says in Isaiah. The spirit of God. Was upon Jesus, the spirit of wisdom, of knowledge and understanding, and revelation. Now there is the spirit. Why do you speak with the day? Your spirit has no revelation. To get to know that this one is dead. A spirit with the knowledge and revelation will know this one is dead. And he told him, You're dead, what are you speaking no for? And set him ablaze. I have hit them with the holes in the beam. And they say you're dead. I see that there's a hand that beat them on the head. And they did. I want God to give your spirit the wisdom, knowledge, and revelation. When you can get another this is spiritual spouse, you not sleep on it. Do you know that it is even the spirit that gets enticed and the spiritual spouse comes and even enjoys? Your spirit enjoys. You wake up when you're still even in the street. Feeling the sweetness. You want to get back in the dream. You say, Ngo, are you feeling good? Oh, Ngo, yogo. Get to know that that spirit. It needs the other and that James what says. Wa kama Somebody who is weak in knowledge. Ah, katonda, Pray to God who never fails to give you wisdom. When my spirit was being used by spiritual spouse, I made that prayer. I said, God, give me the wisdom. The spirit of knowledge, wisdom, and understanding. Can the spiritual spouse use it again? The spirit of strength. The spirit of might. The spirit of cancer and might. We want that one to join us. To be able to possess our possessions. In the name of Jesus. May God bless you. May God bless you. I'll add on from there. The next time. time is gone. We need to pray. We can give in. At Katale. We are building. Sunday school. The church for the children. The church for the children. You and I build it. The money we give in. We are the white men. We are the billionaires. We are the pillars. God uses to do the things. And this evening, take a seed. So it's for building the church for the children. Uh, we are still buying land at Katale. We are enlarging because of the revival. Our father was telling us that the people around there are wishing him to buy them. 
there are many. We need to enlarge. Give us a seed for Balaam. We pay for rent for this place. This place we are in. 58 million. Stand with the rent of this place. We also give in the church, the main in the headquarters. It's not accomplished yet. We also give in for building that one. We give in the tithes and the offering. And other seeds has got guides here. The envelope we are given has these inscriptions there. Show the reason why you have given in. If it's not one of them right there, for I don't think Sunday school is there. You can write there. Sunday school project. Sunday school project. You shall receive your seed. One thing that pleases me with our Father and Eden. Whenever they get money from us, it does exactly the reason for it. If it is for chairs, you see it chairs. If it is a female toilet, you see it there. If it's land, land is bought. If it's Sunday school, the building is going on. The work is going on. When you give somebody your money, and yet they fulfill and they are faithful, that gives you the power to do, so, our pastor has been faithful and the whole management we thank them but we thank you most you are rich men our billionaires our pillars and upholding this work the other, this building is paid by you 58 million I pray for you tonight before the end of this year may God give you money that is reasonable. I pray that money comes from where you don't expect to get into your hands, ladies A blessing from where you least expect. May God surprise you in the area of finances. May God make you meet people who go, are going to change the May God take you to the financial status that are going to change the in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Those without the envelope, raise up your hands and I give it to you. We have finished. Those who have finished. And that online congregants. Or you can put them there and zoom them. And those on the line should also give in. We give it to them. We run and we give it. Because in. our times are for prayer. We need to get empowered. We need to bring down a blessing. We need to attack those rulers of the darkness. Who reign in the heavenly places. Who bound our things. We need them. May God bless you as you give May you. you. May God do you good. May God prosper you. May God please you. I pray blessing that comes from my list. Man that comes from my list. May God pay for you. Where there's no way in this season. May God make you laugh. That in finances. I pray for a blessing of Abraham. Isaac and Jacob. To get into your hands. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. And say amen. amen. Those who are not given in wrong. We get into prayer. May God bless you. Biri Yesu kambi kwe ne wa yonga sadaka omu lilo guje omu yoguange omu yono mu. Yesu kambikoe ne wa yonga sadaka omu diloguje Yesu omu loko. Nesi gelinyalio Iranga we wagamba Chiwe 
Omoyo kwange na kutunda mikono ya sitani Omoyo kwange kubate muna fumo kama Ngate gusobo la kubako chegu kwa tako mose yomoyo Na yinko mye wajole chilo chalero Baibuli etu gambi omoyo kwe gule togu lamo Omobili teguli kwa chegu yinza kugasamo kama Ne wanku batendi moka 
Kampala Mukama, na yowe chalo taina chansi nga tata Chembo denzi jajoli katondo mwesigwa Nganye mosomo yo gwange nguteka mikono jo Emyo yo java na wange mukama njirezi Omo yo gwa mwami wange mukama nguwa yo joli Tata nko miya wansi wa mukono go gwadio Tuende nyama sogo utalibu tokerevo Mukwano gwange soka weba zeko mukama uwe chigambo Echo kuzimbe siye yo moyo Obu sobo zibu obu omoyo Hakanyama kakomoyo Weba zemo kamolo echi gambo chowulide Weba ze katonda kubangolo alero Hazimba kanyama kakomoyo Osobo lokulu anakane nesetani omu wangule Olioko tuke mwisubizo Katonda biya kusubiza Olioko tuke mwagenda Katonda geya tula na atesa Olioko kote kubufumbo Katonda waya kusubiza Olioko kwate kubogaga Emi ntubyo nova dobida vida moyo Na yenga mbidi tobida wa Kumange siye yomoyo ya nyagibwa Siye yomoyo ya wambibwa Na yeye mose dobo zidyo Mama soga mkama Sembira katonda mkwano gwange Yomo sedobo zokabide mkama Omo gambe mkama Kumye wajoli Bayipuli ye gambe kulubelebele mkama Wali wa chigambo chigambo na Fuko mtu chigambo na Vera katonda Hero yoye ya fuko mtu tata Ne mkama wafe yesu ya janga chigambo Tata mnange chigambo Wali wa chewa yogera Na yete wali manye gachitu kideza Omango moyo gwange gubade munafu mkama Omoyo gwange gubade munafu na funyo katonda weje Tata toko choke daka ungezi karero Mokama toko miewo joli katondo mwesigwa Ila toko deme kono jomu nage mokama Tusawo tusasire kulobu talibu toke revo Hemi oja feji wa demi na folo obu tasonywa Obu sungu nga bulimunda mufe mokama Hama nyugo gabate tega inawega yinza kujira Kumange miewo oja feji ono nye Toko miewo joli katonda weje Inze na omu kazo yo mokama Inze na omu sasa Sajo yomo kama, yomo sedo wazo soke wene nye Ngatona itama nye gagwe kumoyo go Obado ino kwe dalikira mokwe Obado judo wenze no bukaba Obado judo malala mkwano Obade wajula dobu chayi Yomo sedo wazo wali ubo nyigide Wali ubo sibide kumotima Aba saja wazene baku iwa Na yenge chizibu chibade kumoyo go Ngate gusobo la kweti kabu sika Obu siko obu fumbo Yimo sedo bozi wene nye Omo gambe moka manko miewo Omo yo gwange kubade monafu Binje bimpise komo kama Ebi sobi zobi zene bigenda Ebi dobi zene bimpitako Na yenko miewo joli Nga nene nyama sogo Wali wabi nari ya moka ma Ebi anafu yo mo yo gwange Wali wabi nari ya mba na moka ma Ebi akubesi yange yo mo yo Tata na yambulu wa monsi yo mo yo Omo yo gwange kubade monafu Bayibuli etu gambie chenko mire Tu benga na manye moka mafe yesu Tu ambale nge vyo kuluwa nyisabyo na Wabanga te tuluwa na gana na mobili na mosai Ne tuluwa na gana na abamanyi Tuluwa na gana na abamasaza Tuluwa na gana na abobu yinza Ne mio ye mibi moka ma Ya jifugira mwengula Omo yomo toko voto kwa miewo Otu saa sile tata Otu sonyi we Awali oku yomba Awali oku era likirida Awali oku kwa muamanyi Awali oku chayi mokama Awali oku sungu mokama Awali amalala mokama Awali oku gezi gezi Awali entondo mokama Awali oku enzino mokama Awali oku emologonya Munange mokama sonyi wa Tata sasira Echibi chatu nafia Echibi chatu ambula Echibi chatu ziba Ama sago moyo Wetu alo koka mokama Netulo ozanga biwede Netule moku mfona Okumanya no kutegera Netu komye ojoli Mazimoto subiza Oyogede na femo kama Bayipuli etu gambi Ti yesu ya janga chigambo Ni isaya ya mogera ko Mo isaya muenda Ti omwana tuzali dua No kofuga kwe Kuna wanga kubibega vega vye Omoyo mbutokofu Yambala na zali bua Na vamo seyo moyo Na damo seyo buliwo Tetu ina manyo mkama Aga jemi tu moyo Okubire tamo seyo buliwo Emi oja fe minafu, emi oja fe tajina maso, emi oja fe munage mokama, akanya matajina, jina lubiri mokama, jalu ala siko sere emi oyo, jalu ala siri mwe emi oyo, na yetu komye wajoli, na yetu gode mikono jo, ngatu sawoto sasire tata, ngatu sawoto sonywe, tubate mungambo, tubate muko sawasala ambi mokama, tulemele dokole bitu yamba, ebi yambe emi oja fe, netu kole bitu, 
Tuta tuyamba mukama ne tukomye wojoli echiro chalero tusonyi we mukama tusasire tata Tubadde mukuge ya mukama tubadde mukwayiriza banafe tubadde mukwegula mukama tulwanye ntalo za mubiri date mibiri tujira biride elane tujirisa mukama elane jigeja nyo mukama emyoyo ne jikoga nyo mukama ne jirwala sikosero owo moyo katonda weje ne jirwale ndwade ezita wonyeze ka mukama ne yetukomye wojoli mukwana kwange sasira sonyi wakatonda weje tunaze no mosayi Omo wendo mungi, tu tu kuzeno msaigo, tu longo seno msaigo, tu kuega iri domo yomo tokovu, ito msaigo ya sugo kunaze, ito msaigo ya sugo kulongo se, kumanga waliwe biso biso, yote kendo kupata ko, omo yogo gugendo pikuata, nemo bidi bidi yoke bife yobida bisiwe, havange ito msaigo mwana kwendiga, ito msaigo wali kaku msalaba, ba yipuli tu gamia mo badi ya mo kumi na msambu. Tukulu soziru no kulibaka wa sumurua E nyomba ya Yakobo editu alevi ntubiayo Hamange kwe nyomba ya Yakobo Gwe katonda kwa sowolo kusumulo moyo Gwe katonda kwa sani doku onyo moyo E chechi vade chaku na fuye chaku nywa mogulamo Wandi wabade na buja munda mukwe mukwano Wandi wakubade kwela likida munange Wandi wakabade maziga mukwano kwange Tomo sayi kwa mwana kwendiga Havanga kutuko zemmemeyo Obato tambuli na mochibi Obato cha yende la dala Obato cha pira dala Omoyo gonga munafu Teku wangu techibi Itomo sayi kwa yesu Neka kukuna zemo kwano Neka kukulongo sesebo Kwa tukendo kuita katondo Molido gocha Mbaipulie tugambie Tiena moliwe wamanyi Omoyo motoko vwari mala kuja kumwe Mwana havanga Mwana havanga majulirua Mosa maria ne mubu yudaya yona Mbaipuli etu gambie Yesu na gamba bayikiri zwabe Jitemo vanga moche senge cha wakolo Bakanga muma zoku batezewa No mo yomo tokovo no muliro Havanga tuetaga kubatezewa Gamba moka mamu yamba zomo yoku angamanyi Tata bate zomo yoku angesebo Wali wemyo ejifugira mabubanga Wali emyo ejiri moche zekeza mokama Wali waba nagwa wali wamo nage mokama Tata munanga bala Angira, haba kwa tebi sobi zomo kama Hama kombe gami nebi sobi zomi ange Nyamba zama nyaka nunu lobo sika wange tata Yamba zomo yo kwanga mani Mbayipuli etu gambi oku vaku bido bia yokano mwatiza Waka 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 tonda wako wakoza Nababu nyaka wangu tawala lwa mani mokama Omo yo kwange teku ina mani tata Omo yo kwange muna funyo mokama Onsobi zabi njibi enteke doko la mokama Neyesi sobo la biko la kubango omo yo muna Homo yo guange guamba za mani Tata batizo mo yo guange No mo yo mo toko vona mani Mogambe Tata mogambo yka ungezi karero Havange yo gena maso gamo kama Mogamba batizo mo yo guo Haku batize no mo lino na mani Ako mo yo mo toko vo Mbaibuli etu gambe matayo satu kuminemo Inti yikana ya janga batiza na mazo kwene nya Na ye yesu ya janga batiza no mo lino no mo yo mo toko vo Have emi kwa Kwa nole kamo kama kubateze no mulilo no moyomo tokovo Kwa chowa na tokeleze misubezo Abateza maso gago moyo Abateza matu gago moyo Abatezo lulimiro mkwano gwange Abange mogambe 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 mokama nyamba za mani Awatari mani ngenda kati wanga sifombitwa Awatari mani ngenda kofanga sezade Awatari mani sigenda kwa tako misobizo Homo yomo toko vole moku mero mulimba Na yobere wa mazime ni obula mwange Gweya yamba za samosoni mokama Jawandiki wa katonda weje Samosoni wali wa mkotava yudaya Ngaba musibie miku wa mnange mokama Neba muwaye mikono java firisuti Neye cha wa Wandike waka 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 Jomo yo wa muka mana muka kona mani Na yo che miguwe jali jimu sibye Na vanga miguwe joke duwa muliro Nyani di zomo yo wa muliro tata Nyani di zomo muliro kwa katonda munda munze Omo yo kwange kubatize no muliro Omo yo kwange kwambaza mani tata 
wali wewe sobeza bya wansobeza wali wabo gaga wenne nokotwala bali ko byoto bya balogo na basamize wali wabo fomba wenne nokotwala wali wabo kaza to demba kamwe nne nokobera wali wotate bipo byange amatwale gange wenne nokoyiwerereza wenne nokuwerereza mukama wali weme samba ne meze mwe jazinda amatwale omoyo motoko bomba tezana muliro bateza kamwa kange mukama batezo moyo gwange mukama gwamba za manye katonda weje omoyo gwange go fole jenjeri zitowa omoyo gwange go fole omulireli emisamba ne meze mwe janya ge byange mukama tataka kaso wenye gwange muri nyalya yeso keso mwana katonda omulamo abange mukama bateze nsiye yo moyo mukama bateze nsiye yo moyo mukwano gwange mukabira ko bateze akwamba za manya gatali gabulijo akwamba zo buyiza akwamba zo buyiza bayipolye tugambye chenko merero tubenga na amanyi momukama wa fe yesu keso twambalenge byo kulanya sabyonna tetumekana na mubiri na musayi tulwana ne miyo yemibi tulwana na aba masaza na abo buyinza ne mezima jefugira mu bife bya wagolo mali nyali ya yeso mwana katondo mulamo bayibuli atugambya mukwano gwange mubakolise chokobire sule ye 10 no nyolo kuna inchentaleza fe mukwano abangi kwane taloza fe seza mubiri entaloza fe za moyo na yeza amanyi okumenya ebigobyo mu bisetani leka mukama kwamba za amanyi agawangule ebigobya setani leka mukama kwamba za amanyi agawangule misambwe ja kunyaga ko bofombo eja twalo mwami wo wali omologe ya kunyaga ko mwami wo wali wa ya kutwala ko bogagabo wali walira mokesa go lwalero go bona bona toyina na mulimu ne yenga wali wa ya kwambulo mokesa era yenga gwa kolera mu era yenga gwa tambulira mu yambala manyo lwalero mogambe mokama nyamba za manye okusobolo kununule byange data yamba somo yo gwanga manye okusobolo komya wobo seka obadde bwa genda mokama obadde bwa nyagibwa mokama obufumbo bwango bwa kwatibwa yamba zomo yo gwanga manye mokama bateza kamwa kange bakama bateze ndowoza yange mokama bateze kamwa kange omoyo gwange go bateze na muliro omoyo gwange gwamba zomuliro omoyo gwange go siba manye omoyo gwange munange mokama omoyo gwe guleto bulamo omubiri tegoli ko chegogasa data cha wandike ba mokama data munange mungera abiri abiri mo mosambo mokama te omoyo gwa mutu yetabaza eri katonda yetabaze kebere bitundu ebyo nda moye mokama moyo kwange tabaza ebadde yazikira mokama imbadde sichala bagendaga imbadde sichasobola kuwangula imbadde nakwa mwamanya gasaba imbadde nakwa mwamanya gasiba imbadde ne wolereza mokama na yolwa lero nyamba za manye na yolwa lero mbateza na muliro na yolwa lero bateza mokama omoyo kwange katonda weje leka mokama ko bateza na muliro leka mokama ko bateza na manye ge abange mokama ko bateza okuwangula omulogo oyo kuwangule meze mojebika kuwangule ya kunyaga kobogaga kuwangule ya twala makago kuwangule misambwa ne meze mo ejuko tobo fumbo bokwano kuwangula manye gachezekeza mokama kobateza mulokole habange mogambe mbateza na muliro leka mokama kobateze no moyo no muliro abango moyo go moyo 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 kayanilo moyo go mokwano kayanile siye yo moyo kayanile siye yo moyo abango vawo badoli ebanga lyo namo kama leka kwambole buli chamba lo chonna setane chabade ya kwambaza omuweleza wa mokama tugambya musumba wa fe nti bible yegamba omusajja yesu na yimira kontana ya lazalo nayo gera ne dobozi tene namo gamba lazalo vaye magombe lazalo na vayo ngasibidwa mabugo habe mikwano na woba dosibidwa na woba dosibidwa like bizina oli ke bigoye byabajjaja babafanga bavo abafanga te bafombe dwa obadolo tagaze mugawe obadolo tagasambwa ye moseddo bozo mugambe mukama nyambula wali chambalo monse yo moyo echifana ganya nabe wafe echikomete komotindo gwe wafe echifana ganya naba fanga te bafombe dwa echambalo setani che yanyambaza echambalo che nyumba ye bokoja emeze mukaje badaje ndabira emeze mukaje badaje tunula najigambo yo we wafe mukama tatanyambule byambalo zanda 
ba ma 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 rima sende de ba ma ma zanda la ba ya ma ma wabe kogo yambo la mokama wabe kogo chali la mokama wabe kogo nyeke la mokama wabe kogo jake chambalo e chenzi na tata e chambalo chobuto e chambale chobuavo e chambalo chobuta formula e chichi debo cheba mwanza tata le kakuambule akoba tesa na muriro e la kuambule bikate akoba tesa na muriro ata kuambule bikate akoba tesa na muriro akuambula gamba la geko abangu guari koma wanga abata kaba mazika na webo zaci chewaba mokwano guanga yesu yaze azoko ambula azoko nunulo moyogo akoba tesa na muriro akoba tesa na manyege akuwa mani ne mbavo esi yo moyo toli konsi ya moyo sense yo mobiri omoyo kwe gule tobula mo ebintu yo nabi kolebwa bisoke na monsi ya moyo nebi vayo nebi da monsi yo mobiri abange meze moji bata jikamba oja koma koko virota oja koma koko viraba monsi ya mobiri monsi ya moyo abange chewa niki mga inti abobo naba fila moko kereza ebi sobi zonga babide ngele na wala elanga babida mosabu la mosa mwari nyari ya yeso mwana katondo mwana mo mwakama na mosese ebi sobi zobi ange oko male panga dene nandi baten na tandi katabo kama nandi baten di wala nyotata nandi baten na fumbiru wa dana wana nenzala na ya kasena kano kadie ingana wana seba ina ole songe ebi sobi zobi ange seba tena manye kabi jamonsi ya moyo oko bine tamonsi ya mwani wo oko bine kwata komonsi ya mwani wo eloru wale lobo kama nyambala manye na obu yinza oko lomba gane jemi sahamwa oko lomba gane jemi mezemo ngaba chawandi kiwatata mabalome 10 na mukaga na nyolwa bidisebo ikatondo we mirembe hata munanga libe tenta setane wasi we bigere bya pe alibe tenta jemi sambwa alibe tenta jemi zemo ejigamba toli bikwata ko ejigamba toli bifuna ejifogira mo banga emyo yo jefogira mo banga eja kwa tembaga yo eja kwa tokudibwa moko eja kwa tamagenda go eja kwa toboga gabo eja kwa tebi byo byonna abange yambala manyo jirombe yambala manyo jirombe Emeke saje jo di mbanga, emeke saje di mbanga, abanga emeke sajo, eje di mbi febi hawa golo, jo teke doko atako, waliwa ba masaza, waliwe mi oye mi bi, eje foke damu wengola, waliwe zensole zamalala, waliwe di soli akamonye, eje ba deli la emeke sajo, yamba la manyo jirombe, yamba la manyo juwa nolo yo, emeke sajo di mbanga, emeke saje di mbi wengola, emeke saje di mbi febi hawa golo, impa. Anole meke sa jange, kwa tependu zoye gulu, oku anole meke sa, emeze moja jale meda, emeze moja jale kwata, 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 emeze
Wabango moyo gogo funye masozi Wabango wangula Wangula gatambo Wangula gatega gewa mwe Wangula jobo tafumirwa Wangula doko liomo tego Wangula 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 Echilo chanelo wangula Echilo chanelo wangula wafo Abadeba janeba kutuala kebibyo Ate toru alelo Nambaga na kwenda chuwele Eko sewe njegele Eko jako wani change Choba dewa nyaka Choba dewa kwata Choba dewa wamba Evi atrawa magombe Yeba teke magombe Moka moya sami ya malalo Oko jayo wani change Emeze moja chanyaka Na jejitu wala magombe Mwani nyali ya yeso keso Omwana katondo mulamo Mwani change chatu waliwa Mwansi ye magombe Mwansi ye magombe Amanya gaya sami ya ntawa Yesu waya tomo yogwe Ejijini liya yugri kamo Wabini katonda weji Esine kankana Enja zine zatika Etana nyingine zibi kuka Ezali zabi kawa Ava tukufu Ava ngene bazuke ziwa Wali chichecha tuali we magombe Wali chichecha nyagiwa Ava siko wanyagiwa Nebo tuali wa mwasie magombe Yesu nga waya imine kontana Na itala zale magombe Ava ngobo sika wabu vayo Hebi vya vipayo Hebi ya pabi ya mataka Ama yomba go Ama motoka go Hemba gaya ya tuali we magombe Hava nga jite 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 vayo Jite chino chalero Jite chino chalero Hava nga go sika wo Sabine mkwano kwange Havange luano lutalo nunule bibyo Havange luano lutalo nemyo ya jefoki na moche zekeza Nemyo ya jefoki na moche zekeza Eti ya kwa teza delio Nyeba zekenda ayo Nema gombe vayo Havange magombe vayo Omuloge ya kuloga na gamba tolizala Oliko makobo fombo na ye tolizala Yambala manyo suke yenda ayo Yambala manyo je yenda ayo Yambala manyo je yenda ayo Oteke doko zala wana Abobu wala na abobu lenze Embaga ye vayo Obanga baje zeka magombe Habange miyo ye jefugi na moche zekeza Lombe miyo ye jefugi na moche zekeza Lomba gane je miyo ye jekuta Mwari nyari ya yeso jekuta Ababa fubo wa dolota Baba denga wa jakuno na bibyo Neba miserenge sema gombe Baba dewa jaga kuno na bibyo Na ye yeso wa ye yogene na wagolo Ne dewa ze dene na zalo na fe magombe Na wali chichecha teke we magombe chifayo Embaga yange jesike magombe Embaga yange uluanele fayo Nga wuni yange faye magombe Mpeta yange nji itabo kama Eza deli yange nji je magombe Mali nyari ya yeso mwana katondo mulamo Hebi na mbubi yange bia nyaki watata Obo gaga wango watu wali mwayo Lelo mwafayo Sente mwafayo Sente zange zifayo Sente zange zifayo Ama genda goga fayo Omwami wafayo Havanga maka goga fayo Visa ne pasipoti yo Olwane le fayo Jeba mali wafayo Wamba, eme zemo jeshika, eme sambo jeme jeshika Havange java fava fanga bafo Bakwa ta ticket yo, bakwa ta visa yo, bakwa ta passport yo Jeshike yo, jeshike yo, jeshike yo, jeshike yo Eva dema gombe vivayo, mali nyari ya yeso mwana katondo mula mo Ate te jeme sambo na eme zemo Ah, yes. 
In the power of the Holy Spirit. Self Spirit of the Lord fell upon me with your power. You fell upon something while it was bound. With the new ropes and the chains. When you speak of the Lord fell upon him. You fell upon him with all your mightiness. And the chains that was bound in him. The cords with which he was bound. He came like a thread is bound with fire. Say, O Spirit of the Lord, I had the cords of the enemy. I had the chains of the enemy. But today is evening. I welcome you, Spirit of the Lord. I welcome you, Holy Spirit. You fall upon me with the power. You fall upon me with the power. That's the Spirit of the Lord. It's here again for this evening. I had laid. I had failed. Things were failing. I, I was stuck in somewhere. But Spirit of God, today's evening, like it was upon Samson, fall upon me with the power. Fall upon me with the mightiness. Say, O oh God, you spoke in Joel chapter 2, verse 28. In the end of times, you can pour out your spirit upon all those with the flesh. Father, I also can pour your spirit upon me. Pour your spirit upon me. Begin to welcome him. Welcome the spirit of God. He's joining you. The power that falls upon you. Something falls upon you. The spirit of that brings life. The spirit of God that resists the dead. That brought letters from the grave. That God gives us from the grave. That breaks the chain. Who breaks whatever bounds. Welcome him. Welcome the spirit of the Lord. Welcome the spirit of the Lord. Jesus you promised us. That you'll baptize us. With the spirit and the fire. And today's evening says. Baptize a man. Baptize a lady. Let there be drunkenness. Let there be drunkenness. We welcome your spirit. Spirit of the Lord I welcome you. Beat that man over the land. Over the land on the land. Over that office. Over that sitting room in the house. Over that house and that vehicle. You hover there in the beginning. When things are not over there. Spirit of the come and hover. Hover with your fire. Hover with your mightiness. Break some chains. Break the cords. And David is saying. That I was bound in the court of death, and that bound me tight. And I called on the Lord, called on the Spirit of God, called on the Spirit of God. You were in the chains of sickness. You were in the chains of rejection. You had the chains of no money. You had the chains of poverty. The chains of lack that bound you. You had the chains of no money. The chains that are broken. The chains that are broken. Call on the spirit of God. Break the chains. Break chains. Raise those hands unto the spirit of God. I hear that a minister is already here. Something touched me that was heavy. I'm going to do something that is heavy. It's the heaviness of the Spirit of God that falls upon you. It's going to take out the bounding spirit. The heaviness of the Spirit of God is attacking whatever bound you. Attacking the dead. Attacking the thumb. Attacking that mame. Whatever was against. There's the heaviness. There's the fire. The fire of the Spirit of God. Jesus promised us to baptize us with the Spirit and the fire. 
We dress with the fire. We dress with the fire. Right from my hair. Up to down. Say, Spirit of God. Come to me with the fire. Say, Spirit of God. Come to me with the fire. Speak it as you mean it. Spirit of the Lord gives you fire. Come to you with the fire. Shadow with the fire. And the journey that bound you. The demons that are bound you. That bound your feet. That bound your destiny. They set you with the fire. They set free with the fire. There is something that goes with the fire. They are set free with the fire. Something is set ablaze. They are set ablaze. Garments are set ablaze. The filth is set ablaze. The heads of garments are set ablaze. The slaves and lack are set ablaze. The accursed and lack are set ablaze. What do you want to do? Someone who dresses with fire. Someone who baptizes with fire. Baptizing your spirit. Raise up the hands and be quiet. Raise up those hands and mute. Something joins you. Someone joins up your life. Someone visits you. Something hovers your spirit. There is. Who embraces your spirit. Is empowering you with fire. Commenting you with fire. I don't know what I feel, what I feel. But the fire is abound. The spirit of the Lord is in this house. He joins you where you got stagnant from. When things had failed. Something I feel as we wind up. As you raise up those hands. Isaiah says. Children are ready to be burned. But no power to deliver them. I feel there is a man and a woman. Your season was due. It was about to go by you. There's a baby to be born. But the power to deliver the baby. That are pugs that join you. You receive the pugs to deliver. There's a child being born a minister. The spirit of the Lord empowers you with the power to deliver the baby. And the angel told Mary that the spirit of the Lord shall come upon you. And the power of the Almighty God are going to overshadow you. Child to be born, there will be the fire. As a child who has been asking yourself, how do I go through there? How do I get out of this? How do I pay the debts? How do I get citizenship. How do I get the papers? Can Hansa be here? Can get out of rubbish? How do the children go to school? Business are lost if jobs are failed. Pastor have nowhere to go. Hello? The spirit that came upon Mary and gave her child of God. What was just a mere word? When the spirit of God descended, came upon Mary and overshadowed her. The baby was born. It's the power that joins you. It's the power that joins you in this season. There is this, the divine child who is going to be born. There is a child being born in your ministry. There is a child of God There is a child of marriage is born. A child of moving nation is being born. A child of begetting healing. The part that makes you deliver that of God. Joins you. Joins you. Joins you. Children were ready to be born, but there was no power to deliver them. I want to proclaim that power unto your life. In this very week we are in, you're delivering a baby. The word becomes a living person. The Spirit of the Lord causes the word to become a living being. Joins you. 
There is your testimony somewhere. What breakthrough agenda? There is a kubotola that I see. What was just a good agenda? The open doors that I see. What walk one is ever healing? Have I no kusumu and deliverance? The cords that have bound you, they are broken in the power of the Holy The cords that have bound you, they are broken. Because the Lord takes away every cast from you and every failure and every cast. The Spirit of the Lord anoints you. The Spirit of the Lord they all raise it up to horn. That is the value that is destroyed tonight. That came from your father and man. It is destroyed. The spirit of the Lord diseases something. Something starts up tonight. We've been pregnant, ladies and gentlemen. By the time for delivering the babies has come forth. In the power of the Holy Spirit. There's a child born today. Is a child being born today? There is a child being born now. Not in many days, gentleman lady. You'll be witnessing for the child born. When the spirit of the Lord attacked Mary, when the spirit joined Mary, when his power overshadowed her, I question is well answered. There is a man and there is a woman. The spirit of God answers the question that came with here. Because we're on the line, your questions are answered today. How will it be like? It takes the spirit of God to answer every question. Those watching me on the line, the spirit who answered this question of my answered your question, lady. The question you had in your life for long. The answers come unto you. I proclaim that answer to come to you. In the power of the Holy Spirit. There are sicknesses that vanish. There are dreams that vanish. There are destinies that are set free. There are hands that are set free. The Bible says, You remember your Lord God. For He gives you the power to retain and make well your hands. The Spirit empowers them to make wealth, to retain wealth. Tonight, mm. the Spirit of the Lord makes no so strong and ability to receive great things, to receive wealth. A minister, there is a person whether on the line or in this building there is a man you have been waiting for long it was a baby that had failed pit pipeline. it was in the pipeline you have been seeing the money but something hindered it there is the power that joins your hands and the child is born You've been demanding. You've been selling something. You had sold off something. They returned the money. Tonight, this power that joins you, the money you've been waiting for long, has been set free tonight. Something you have been waiting for for long that in a few days you will have received that money. The power of the Holy Spirit I proclaim babies to be born. May that testimony come to me. May the spirit of softness come and fall upon you swiftly. God says it when it's time to come. He's going to quicken it. I proclaim the power of swiftness. Anointment of swiftness. Grace of swiftness. Join you.
The spirit and the hand of God that joined Ezekiel when he went to the valley of dry bones where there was no life. The spirit of the Lord got in the valley and those who were dead what was death became a valley of living and there was an army the spirit that joins you the spirit of the Lord of life in the valley of losses you have been in of lack and faith Isaiah Gamba until when the spirit is born what was a desert becomes a fertile ground the spirit of the Lord is poured upon the being in the desert of life the desert of marriage the lack of no favor in the desert of being in the spirit of the Lord that invades that desert becomes a fertile garden becomes a forest there is an overflow there is the, the ripeness of God. I see a Before a man and a woman. I see green fields. A midst of us. And I proclaim that. Starting from today's evening. Begin to retain your health. Let that was the promise. Become a leader. What was the prophecy that laid be manifested this week? Starting from today's evening. I proclaim its fulfillment in the power of the Holy Spirit. Like it was written, not by power, not by authority, but by the Spirit of God. By the Spirit of God. There is a child being born. By the Spirit of God. There is something broken. By the Spirit of God. Change that has been broken. By the Spirit of God, you move nations. By the Spirit of God, you get married. By the Spirit of God, you live this. By the Spirit of God, I proclaim the promotion. By the Spirit of God, those who come for long time, I proclaim starting from tonight, begin to make prophecies. In the remaining days in this year, I proclaim the same of miracles, of wonders, and signs for the Spirit of God. You have gotten into your seasons of prophecy. You have gotten into your days of prophecy. Today's evening, there is a man, there is a woman. God will make you pleased before you sleep. I've heard that the Spirit of the Lord tell you to. In the name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God, may God bless you. May God make you laugh. May God make you enter your days. Every prophetic that the prophet in the name of Jesus we love you so much and be, bye bye we love you so much may God protect the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all and all the brethren forever and ever Amen Goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives in Jesus' mighty grace and mercy go follow you gentlemen lady my sister my brother in Christ Jesus amen, amen.